What's happening, everybody? It's Sean with Reactions to the Classics, and today we got a reaction to Love is the Answer by England, Dan, and John Ford Coley for our friend, longtime supporter, and patron of the channel, Nathan. Thank you, Nathan. Thank you to all the patrons who make this thing go. We would not make it without you. If you'd like to support us in any way, check out the Patreon link below. The patron link on the end screen. I know these guys. I know England, Dan, and John Ford Coley from one song. I'd really love to see you tonight, which was a number two hit in 1976. But they are an American soft rock duo composed of Danny Wayland, England, Dan Seals, and John Edward, John Ford Coley. They were active throughout the 1970s. Now, Dan Seals went on to be a country star in the 80s. I actually do know who he is. I didn't know he was the England Dan. This song, as Nathan, our patron who requested it, tells me, it was originally written and performed by Todd Rundgren for his band Utopia, but most know this version. Complete perfection, he says, the message holds true today as much, if not more, than when it was originally written. It, the song did go to number 10 on the Billboard Hot 100 charts in May of 79. It's been two weeks atop the adult contemporary chart. John Ford Coley was quoted as saying, quote, of all the things we released as singles, that was my favorite. The song, first of all, had a classical bass and the middle had a gospel section, which I loved. So it's off the 1979 album, Dr. Heckle and Mr. Jive. All right, thanks again, Nathan. Let's check it out.
Love is the answer. Just the smoothness, man, of England, Dan, and John Ford Coley. I think I sort of know that. I mean, the, the chorus of it a little bit. You know, 79, I would have been eight years old, seven, eight years old, depending on when it came out. Uh, name your price, a ticket to paradise. I can't stay here anymore. And I've looked high and low. I've been from shore to shore. If there's a shortcut, I'd have found it, but there's no easy way around it. Why do the world shine on me? Love is the answer. Shine on us all, set us free. Love is the answer. So you can take this kind of two different ways, right? Just the love that we've got to have love for one another. Or why do the world shine on me? That, you know, for those of us who are Christians, the light of God, the light of Jesus Christ, shine on me. Love is the answer. But who knows why someday we all must die. We're all homeless boys and girls, and we are never heard. So once again, there's definitely some Christian overtones here, but that might not have been the way it was uh, intended. But just the smoothness to us, the arrangement, the instrumentation, it's definitely adult, contemporary, laden, man. you got a great soprano saxophone from Ernie Watts. The great Steve Lukather from Toto is on here because those guys worked as session musicians. Um, yeah, choir in here. I mean, you just got everything in here. But the guys sound so smooth. So thank you to Nathan for bringing this great message in this song and just a really good song. Thanks to everybody who has watched this. Uh, let me know your comments below. What do you think of this song? What else should I check out from these guys? And until next time, guys, I will see you.